retirees? Nah, just stuff. Windows, antenna, tires, vermin. Ah, so that was you. Tis the season for it. I'll give a shit about no season. <laughs> oh, good, huh? Don't let the regulations get you down. That's what I'm saying. Hey, hey, hey. You want to come hunting with me? It'd be real neighborly of you. Hell, why not? All right, then. Up here with you. I got just a thing. Let's raise some hell, neighbor. Oh, I'm in. I'll introduce you to one of my all-time favorite pastimes. <laughs> You're gonna love this. Okay, you see them three big satellite dishes? A decent shot, and they'll go down easier than a whore's drawers. You're a real pillar of the community. Yeah, that's it. Give them hell. Shoot another one. <laughs> no more reality TV for you, Mrs. Gilbert. Okay, one more for the rough. Boom! <laughs> Didn't I tell you this would be more fun than a barrel full of pussies? Ooh, you're a classy date, Cletus. No denying that. <laughs> now drive us up to that abandoned motel. I got an even better idea. So, what now? We gonna try our luck on something less stationary. Ooh, liberals? <laughs> Nothing as slippery as that. You'll see. It's all the way up on Algonquin Boulevard. Reckon we should drive it. Here we are. I bet you never shot out the tires on a car before? Oh, you'd be surprised. Well, let's see what you got then. Ain't you gonna shoot anything, Cletus? Nah, I do this all the time, and I want to see how you deal with a moving target. This is perfect right here. Pick a car and shoot a tire. Good plain old fashioned fun.
Don't be shy. Tires don't feel no pain. Come on! Gotta show them sometimes you ain't a slave to the system. When in doubt, take him out. What? That's it, beauty. And again, Trevor. Pop the tires is much more fun. Not the car, Trevor. Dumbass. Hellfire, Trevor, you ain't rushing this, are you? Nice! Go on, one more, just for the hell of it. Looks like maybe you could use some more practice. Right, let's change it up. Come on, follow me. No harm done. Only in Sandy Shores. Just two fellers killing time in small town America. Don't get much better than this, does it? The two most popular guys in town. Am I glad I ran into you? Ain't nowhere near this fun being antisocial on your own. Whatever cranks your tractor, I say. What's up next on the hillbilly anarchist agenda? Ever shot anything with a face? Actually, let me ask it again. Ever shot anything with a face on four legs? Now, Cletus, it's important you realize I'm a man plagued by vicious rumors. Fine. Let's head for the roof. I seen some coyotes hanging around down by the road. Reckon it would be real neighborly of us to get rid of a couple. And we are nothing if not neighborly. You're as graceful as a pig on ice. We'll get a better shot from up here. All right, I see him. Looks like we got two packs of coyotes down there. Take a few of them out and the rest should scatter. Sing to me now, song dog, and another. Damn, you're shaking like a dog pooping peach pits. Dropped it like a bad habit. I think you got one more in you, Trevor. Before. That should do it. <laughs> Nicely done. I reckon you should tag along next time I go hunting out at Polito Bay. I'll show you how to bag an elk. Eh, why not? All right, gotta go. I'll send you a text when I'm about. Should start calling you Mal Coordinator. Would you open your fucking eyes? I'll have to keep an eye out for you.
Out you get, buddy! Damn! Bullshit! You're still banned. What about these two? Whoever wins gets banned. <laughs> He's one. Ban him. I can't ban him. He's my goddamn husband. He's young enough to be your son. Ain't the internet a beautiful thing, honey? Anyway, I mm. saved your husband. Now get me a drink. I got a meeting. Okay, but any more bodies turn up in my bar. I swear, I will not serve you. Mr. Phillips. Ah, uh, here he is. Yes, Mr. Chang, pleasure to meet oh, you. No, I am Mr. Chang's humble translator. Mr. Chang now. You all speak Spanish, speak it to each other! Mr. Tao Chong is uh, pleased to meet your acquaintance. Oh, yeah, he seems it. Wrong with him? I'm out. No, don't go! Please! I beg you, if you go, his father kill me. Why do I give a fuck? You don't, but we hear that Trevor Phillips' corporation is serious business. We pay good price. Things work out, we partner, make big money. <laughs> I'm rushing! Well, let me show you the operation. This is us. You can't get here quick enough! The Aztecas are coming! They think you took out Ortega! They ain't mistaken. Well, get down here and take them out, too! Fine, shit. You sure your boss don't want this crank for his own personal consumption? No, no. Mr. Cheng Sr. is very specific. He wants a good, reliable source of methamphetamine. We will buy from you here and distribute using established networks. I'm worried that might dilute what our operation's all about. We're part of the slow meth movement, bio-regional, locavores only. Shit, Trevor! We ain't got long! Whoa, 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 manor chef! These are our guests, all right? We got Mr. <laughs> Chang and his humble servant. Hey, Lo uh, Shung! <laughs> nice to meet you. Trevor, we ain't got long till they get here. Everything in its time, all right. Gentlemen, please, come check out the storage facilities. Go on now. Nice, right? Oh, <laughs> Ample room inside. Mr. Cheng, please, sir, if you will. Let me out! Tour will recommence shortly, gentlemen. 
Should we get the guns? Yes, Chef. Help me! If I knew we were having visitors, what is that little spring clean? They really want you dead. Report. I should uh, check on the Chinese delegation. They might be catching a chill. Yeah, all right, time to recommence the tour, gentlemen. <laughs> Woo -hoo! Woo -hoo! Woo -hoo! I think we have seen quite enough. Uh, I'll swing by and sign the contracts, all right? Just ignore the bodies. Hey, Trevor. Are we still gonna cook that batch? Fuck yeah! gonna meet a bitch, that's where you're gonna meet one, you know what I'm saying? Hey, hey. Give me a sip of that. What? Come on! My throat's dry as a motherfucker. Why? Is your mother dry when you're... <laughs> 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 what the fuck is that, huh? Nothing. Well, it didn't sound like nothing, all right? It didn't seem like nothing. I don't think that it was nothing. Look, I didn't mean nothing by it, old man. Old man? 
old man. Fuck you, you creepy old motherfucker. That's right. I said it. Creepy. Old. Motherfucker. No. Jesus. Huh? No, come on. What? Up. What? What? Sorry. Now, where I'm were sorry. we on, exactly? Get up, huh? Get up. Uh, I'm sorry, man. We're help. sorry. Help! There's a guy with a gun. Ass wipe. Bean machine. Richard Fern. You sure as shit are one dumb, ignorant, white trash hillbilly, Wallace. <laughs> You're damn right. <laughs> Chang, spreadsheet. Let's head outside and talk terms. La 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 la. Quite in. Gentlemen, I think I have proved that my organization can handle. Wait. And I think I've proved that my organization is a reliable supplier. In short, it's you and me. Now give me some of that goddamn X. I'm afraid we want to go down a different path. What? We want to explore other opportunities. Why, Jaho? Why, sir? Shut the fuck up! Our boss, Mr. Cheng's father, wants something a little larger. 
We want to move drugs, perhaps guns. This is my life's work. I mean, since I was a little kid, I, I dreamt big. You know, I've always wanted to be an international drug dealer and, and a weapons trader. All right, so I'm begging you. Let's make this happen. I'm very sorry. You're sorry? You're fucking sorry? I just spilled my fucking guts out to you, and you say to me you're sorry. Who are you working with? Hmm? Who? I'm not at liberty to say. Oh, no, no, no. You're at fucking liberty. In fact, I'd say you are obliged. <laughs> who? Fucking who? 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 The O'Neill brothers. The O'Neill brothers, huh? Yeah. You shitting me? No. Because those fucking O'Neill brothers, I hear a little birdie telling me that they have a bit of a problem, since one of them's gonna have to be surgically removed from the skull of the other. Fuck you guys and fuck them! Phillips! Elwood O'Neill! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Fuck you! Trevor, it's business! That wide-eyed idiot was mine! It's business, fella! You wanna discuss it? We're at the farm. Ernie, Earl, Walton, Wynn, Dale, Doyle, Daryl, Dan, all of us. Start writing those names on tombstones! Cause I'm on the way to your lab and we're gonna see how much of a family meth business you got when I'm done! Mm. They're dead, all of them, inbred hillbilly twats! Get fucked. I just spoke to that maniac Trevor. He's coming. Get down to the meth lab to protect it. Right. I hope he don't get through these idiots, but we know they're idiots. Come on, let's go see them Chinese fellas. Oh, how many brothers you got, you inbred freaks? I don't know how I'm gonna. Do it, but I'll kill the lot of you and I'll torch your cookhouse. Do it, but I'll kill the lot of you and I'll torch your cookhouse. Come on now. He missed me. We got a Kill you! Oh, how many brothers you got, you inbred freaks? I don't know how I'm gonna do it, 
but I'll kill the lot of you, and I'll torch your cookhouse. It's started, people! Come on! Oh, well, he's been oh, hit! Oh, he's a piece of shit! shit. It's happening! Get out of here! Uh, get you are get dead. behind something! Keep him out of the lab! You're all dead! You motherfucker! You gonna be buried in this basement! Hey, fat ass! He ain't taking our price! You wanna see competition in the marketplace? Yeah, fucking weirdo, get gone. Hey, shit bird. Stand down. Hide. Get that motherfucker out the house. Get your own fucking business. You got a bleeder. You assholes. Trevor Phillips, man. Fuck him. Come on. Tear Rivers here to kill ya. You know Yeah, fuck asshole. you, dealer man. You motherfucker. Keep him out of the fuck. <gasps> well. Oh, fuck me. Help fuck me. me. It's Phillips. Me. Don't look like I a larger operation. You gotta feed on me. <sighs> you get out this property. Yeah. How about a merger, you prick? <sighs> he ain't taking our crazy asshole. Get cover. It's over. You gonna die in this cookhouse? Crap! He's heading for the basement. Stay away! Ya fucking weirdo! Get gone! Ugh. Fucking O'Neills! I'm coming for you! Don't let him down here! Shit! He's in the lab! Don't come any close! Gas in a meth lab! Oh, you're gonna burn, you idiots! Here we go!
You asked for this, assholes! Smell those fumes! Yeah, you've only yourselves to blame. You disrespectful pricks! Hope you're gonna pay this time, Trevor. You. Hope. What? Forget it. Just don't break anything or hurt me. The cheek of it. Maybe I'll pay, maybe I won't. We're two local businesses supporting each other, Melvin. I don't have to shop here. All the disreputable people smuggling guns into the country these days? Just be grateful for my patronage. Of course. Sorry, Trevor. Had Cletus in here earlier, picking up something special for his girl. A tricky one to explain to the cops. That's you all done.
Shit! Cops! Copy that, dispatch. Animals on the loose. Get back here! You're not even hidden! Have you got it? I've been trying, Trevor. I've been trying. Come on over here, all right? I ain't gonna hit you. I've been trying. I know, I know. I thought you said you weren't gonna hit me. I thought you said you were gonna find fucking Michael Townley. There's... Two Michael Townleys living in L.S. One is 83, and the other one is at kindergarten. I asked the teacher to put him on the phone just to be safe, but she threatened to call the cops. I ain't no molester, Trevor. Shut then up I before I molest you, all right? Now, is there anything else? I, I look through the phone directory. I did find a, a Michael DeSanta. About the right age, married with two kids. What's his wife's name? Amanda. Amanda? Yeah. You're a genius, you moron. Come on, uh, come here. Uh, Woo! Uh, uh, don't you ever not tell me things I want to know! Sorry, Trevor. Run, you little bastard! Get out here! We're going to Los Santos. Are we? Not you, me and Wade. What about me? You're CEO of Trevor Phillips Enterprises. Find us some business so that we can make some money and tidy my shit up. Let's go. Wait, come on. I'm driving. You can jerk me off if I get bored. I'm joking. You can suck me off. Are we going to stop for ice cream? Um, <laughs> so, so, so we're headed to Los Santos then? Soon. I gotta make a stop. Oh, what's your stop? Ice cream? Road trip? We taking this one? Get in! Where are your people at in Los Santos? It's just my cousin there, Floyd. He's bunked in with his girlfriend someplace called Vespucci Beach. So, uh, what's your stop? Family's important, Wade. Not as important as the man that's employed you, mentored you, and fed you amphetamines this last year, but it's important. We gotta pay this cousin a visit. I ain't seen him in a while, Trevor. All the more reason to drop by. Okay, um, I got my big eyes, but where are we stopping on the way? Cause you know, I'm getting kind of wet over here. For fuck's sakes, another chapter of the Lost descended on this fine town. Looking to mourn and maybe revenge their dead. I was thinking me and you could pay our respects. Trevor, I, I, I don't think we'd be welcome there. I mean, what do you want to... The Lost Camp. Ooh, I got some fond memories of this place.
got you them bombs and that pistol with the thing that makes it quiet on it. Yeah, I took them. Those are my gifts for these pricks.
Can I go okay? I heard about your banging and screaming, but can not knock the guy's time. Yeah, I went good, Wade. Woo! Shit! Again! Again! We don't have to think about the loss no more. Let's go find my old buddy. This Michael Townley guy must have pissed you off real bad for you to want to find him so much. He didn't piss me off. The guys that killed him, the federal government, they pissed me off. But if he's dead, who's this? Now you're starting to grasp the pertinent questions. Who is this guy using my dead friend's tired-ass movie quotes with my dead friend's alias and my dead friend's family in a house that must have been paid for with my dead friend's stashed millions? Wow, that's a real mind fuck. Yeah, I'll show you a fucking mind fuck. I'm gonna stick my boy in your eye. It's gonna come out of your ear, huh? I, I, I didn't mean anything by that, P. Trevor, lube up your eye hole, fucker. Cause I'm gonna fuck your tiny mind, huh? I am about ready to turn you into roadkill. Uh, please, don't turn me into anything. I just want to be Wade. Are we nearly there yet? No, Wade. Are we nearly, nearly there? You keep this up, you're not gonna get there at all. Can you tell me a story? No, Wade. Let's play a game then. You know animal, mineral, or vegetable? I'll go first. I'm nanotechnology. Uh, you're what? Ooh, damn it. I gave it away. I wasn't, I wasn't supposed to say what I am. I'll start again. Animal, vegetable, or mineral? Hey, 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 how about this? I'll tell you a story, if you promise never to speak again. I like stories. Of course you do. This story's about a boy called Tr... Tr... Uh, Trisha. Is Trisha a boy's name? It doesn't matter. Sounds weird. He was weird. He was the smartest, toughest, weirdest kid in Canada. Well, in the Canadian border region of America. Okay. This boy, he had all the talent. Charisma and guile that a boy could have, but he didn't know what to do with it. That's it. That giant sprawl. Los Santos. Oh! Kick again! Kick again! So, this is Bo Santos. I guess it is. I always wanted to come here. But you got stuck in the desert? It's still San Andreas. Best part of the state. So, Michael, this is where dead men come back to life. It's been nearly ten years, but you'll keep for another day or so, huh, old friend? You motherfucking fuck! I grieve for you! You weren't even fucking dead. You were my best friend. Well, guess who's coming to shit on your doorstep, you fuck! Floyd ain't around here. What are you doing? Los Santos, the city of shitheads. Where else would he be? Floyd over in Vifuchi Beach. Will you tell me the story about that boy, Trisha? Ah, yeah, yeah, where were we? Right, 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 right. So, this kid, he could fly planes. So, he signed up for the Air Force to fly all day long and bomb villages and maybe, just maybe, drop the nuke. And it was all going well until one day, just before he got his wings, an evil witch in charge of psychological evaluations told him he was unstable and grounded him for life. That's terrible! It was! Sent him into a deep pit of doubt, despair. And just then, ju just as he hit rock bottom, he met a fat, silver-tongued troll under a bridge. That's cool. What was the troll's name? Mike, Michelle. A lady troll? 
Yeah, he had tits like one, but no, no, he, he was a boy. Michelle is a funny name for a boy. Well, this was a funny boy. He sat under his bridge, robbing anyone who passed him by. Sometimes he'd go into town and rob the shops and inns and such. And he persuaded our hero that maybe he should rob people too. And you know what? Little Trisha did rob people, and little Trisha was good at it. And they lived happily ever after? For a while. Until the troll met another troll in a strip club, and they fell in lust. And he bought her a pair of fake troll tits, even bigger than his real troll tits, so she could make more money stripping. Maybe a little on the side without call work, but you didn't hear that from me. Wow. And then she pushed out a pair of little trolls, and the big bad troll under the bridge went soft. Hold on, what? So little Trevor made a new friend called Brad, and he was thinking about cutting Mike off when it all went to shit, and Mike got killed and Brad went to jail. Oh, oh, we're near Floyd Cap. I seen it on I find map. I'll give you directions. You don't turn here. So now here's like a rat. Keep it straight now. This is the place. I think it is at least. Floyd! Floyd! It's up here, Trevor! Floyd, it's me, Wade! Who? Me, Wade, your cousin! Who? Your cousin! Fuck! He's come to visit you, you rude fuck! Now get up off the floor and fix me a fucking drink! Oh, you, Wade! <laughs> I heard you was off smoking meth somewhere. No, not somewhere here. He's gonna smoke meth here. Give me a fucking lighter. You can't smoke here. Okay. <laughs> this is my girlfriend's place. She's at a business conference. You can't smoke here and you can't stay here. How's it going, cousin? It's been a while. Yeah, I ain't seen you since you was called in Evelyn's bed. A guy was never approved. You gotta go, both of you. My girlfriend, she'd kill me if she knew I had guests. Well, it's not much of a girlfriend if she don't like your family. Now, would you get me a fucking drink? I'm not gonna ask you again. Oh, yeah, okay. Wait, uh, I ain't got no booze. Well, then you go out and fucking get me something. You go, too. All right, okay. Fuck. 